Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing, extended, beautiful family, thank you so much for the loving vibes. You're opening up your lives to me. Tell me the experiences you're going through to let you know, okay, this is what you could be or, you know, you're collaborating with this or, you know, it's just things that you're opening up your lives to and you're you know you're being vulnerable and but you're also wanting to know you know more about yourself and you need help with that as long as you're helping me along the way I'm helping you along the way so it's just a good feeling I have that I can share that amongst with everybody so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you've been watching my videos for a while I have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're opening up your life and tell me about the, the things that, you know, has occurred with you being, finding out your impact and how has it affected your life in any kind of way or impacted your life in any kind of way. And, you know, it's all greatly appreciated. Or even if the video just puts you in a good place or gave you some good knowledge or, you know, just put some good you know, good feeling in your life. Go ahead and pass it on to somebody else that you think that might need to hear this message. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. It's all greatly appreciated. And I hope you're able to get some kind of validation or peace of mind from my video. Or I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel. And, you know, thank you. And the positive music, the positive, beautiful music I'm listening to today is boost positivity energy bring positive changes into your life meditation music healing music oh my gosh y'all i definitely recommend this because it just makes me feel like like i don't know like somebody and not you know not to recommend any kind of drug use or anything but it just felt like you know somebody just put a spray to uh like some value in, value mist in the room. <laughs> I'm like, um, <laughs> but you know, I, you know, I'm sorry, but you know, I'm not condoning anything about medication or anything like that, but that's what it feels like. It's like really relaxed, really calm. So I highly do recommend that to anybody who just needs to unwind and just want to just chill out because they're just too uptight and too stressed out. I really recommend that. But anyways, the video today is about Twin Flame 101. Twin Flame 101. All empaths, welcome your gift with no apologies. We need to welcome our gift with no apologies. There are some times that when we find out about certain things about our lives, you know, I've been getting so many questions about people asking, well, can Haokas be this and this and that? Yes. We cannot. We can. We can. We can. We truly can be more than one. We can have more than one gift. Because there's times with me, me being a Haoka, me being a white witch, um, just a regular empath, uh, medium, telekinetic, not telekinetic, but um, what they call it, clairvoyant. Um twin flame indigo so you you can have you can be multi-gifted and there's probably more things that out there that i can resonate with i'm just finding out more things about myself so when i find out more things about myself and on this learning learning experience is called life i don't know what's wrong with my eyelash my eyelash is just working on my nerves but um yeah we're on this verge of life you know you find out all these different things about yourself and sometimes it can be scary sometimes you're trying to understand because i know i was like at first when i found out about the white witch thing i was just like you know and because it's just like i love you know the movies about witches i love the things that i read upon but i also you know, it also bothered me too, with because there's always a white and a dark to things. You know, when you hear about the voodoo, or you know, the bad voodoo, or you know, the bad sensitivity, or the black magic and stuff like that. You know, you you get to hear about the witch trials and stuff, and how people got, you know, burned at the stake and hung just because you had a special gift. So it's just like, thank God nowadays, you know, 
hopefully there's nobody out there practicing that because it just put me in the mind of uh, American Horror Story, The Coven. And it's just like, you know, I had to really look back at life and just look at all the like things that I, I caught interest in me growing up. I used to always want, you know, I used to dress up as a witch a lot, a witch or a fairy. Or something that was positive, you know, that I knew I was bringing something to somebody's life, you know, or other than Frankenstein or something like that. But, you know, that really stuck out to me being like a witch or, um, you know, stuff like that. Just finding out more stuff about myself and it was just more natural abilities of things that I was able to chant and stuff like that. It really made me feel good that I was able to do things like that. So, I mean, yes, it was scary, but then when I look back at the things that I was attracted to growing up, you know, bewitched, uh, charmed, um, Buffy and the Vampire Slayer, the craft, uh, the coven, um, uh, shoot, stuff about witches, um, shoot. um, teenage witch, Sabrina the teenage witch, you know, just things, different things like that, um, that I used to really enjoy growing up that, you know, that I never knew that was going to benefit me in the long run today, so it's just like, you have to look back on your lives and, and see the things that really stuck out to you that you might not have felt that was important to you or irrelevant so it's just like welcome your gift don't be scared of the things that you know you really truly don't understand because it, it just seems like the soul has this kill switch like not kill switch but you know that you know that that switch that lights things up that tragic things has to happen for them you know for things to basically come into light for you like it's been pushing its way towards your way for a long time but it needed something you know um basically to impact your life in a way that you know it'll smack you you know it, it, it's just like smack you know just like put you in a state of shock so it's just like, okay, so now since I got your attention, I need you to look at something this way. You've been looking at things this way, this song. We need you to look at it this way. So it's just like when you when you have your gift, learn more about yourself. Look at the characteristics that, that come, come along with your, your, your personality. You know, learn more about yourself that, you know, knowing, okay, you found this gift of being a Hayoka. There are, might be a lot more things that, you know, comes along with your gift that you might not even know about or it's just things that you have went through that you probably suppressed it and you're like, wait a minute, you know, I never knew I was like this or whatever, but you have been this whole time. It's just, you've seen, you've had signs, but you probably, you know, played it off as something just, oh, okay, it's just a coincidence. Nothing is never accident or coincidence. So it's just... Let Google be your best friend. You know, read up on things. If you like going to a library and reading up on books, find things that, you know, that take your interests, that spark your interests. That, that, that might even start off a new career for you, um, which I'm doing for myself. I love learning more and more things about my life, the more things that I know I can help others with that might be going through the same thing. You know, it, it was a scary thing because it's unknown. You know, we fear what we don't understand. We fear, you know, trying to walk off into that darkness and don't know what the heck we're walking into. But we have to have faith that, you know, we're not going to, you know, you might get hurt or whatever, but, you know, nothing's going to make you go over the edge or whatever. He might want to send you there. <laughs> it might want to send you there. You might want to be wanting to leap off of it. But, you know, the universe has our back. You know, even sometimes it might get hard, you get frustrated, you want to curse the universe, curse God, or whatever. But know that, you know, when you're going through these tough trials and tribulations, no one is going to give you that strength that you really, truly have had in you this whole time. But it just needed something to have that kick punch to just light it up. So don't be afraid of the things that are entering your life. Don't be afraid of the unknown, which is hard to do, but we have to take those limited chains off ourselves. You know, step outside the box and be able to just know, you know, what government or whatever people try to tell us. No, there's more than what we truly know about each other or even ourselves. So pay attention to those things. 
So I hope you were able to get something out of this video. I hope you had a blessed week. You know, like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know I'm about to upload my next video. You know, I would love to hear from you. So drop me a line or two. And, you know, if you, even if you feel comfortable enough, you can go ahead and tell me about, you know, your empathic gift. Or even just give me positive feedback about the video that you just watched. So, you know, send out as much love and positivity as you possibly can. And like I said, know that you are truly blessed and highly favored. Know that you are ultimately truly loved. And know there is always somebody out there praying for your better goods. So, better goods, better days, better goods, better, just better everything for you. <laughs> so, send out much love and life positivity as you possibly can. Like and subscribe. Even drop me a line. I'd love the chance to hear from you. And even if this video just put you in a good spot and you know somebody else might need to hear it, go ahead and pass it on towards them. They might, you know, truly appreciate that. And I will see you on my next video. Peace and be wild.